because it's an opportunity for me to be able to process those things, evaluate them, identify what's not working for me and start over, right? And add plus one. I always ask myself, how many, how many mistakes have I made today? Because it's an opportunity for me to be able to process those things, evaluate them, identify what's not working for me and start over, right? And add plus one. And you look back at your life and you go, oh my goodness, four years ago, like, like, or th three or four years ago, this, this saying right here, my name is Danelle Osborne and I give people the tools to unlocking the chains that weigh them down. Like, I probably would have never believed that. And now I know that, right? And so what are you doing today to propel yourself? What are you doing to tomorrow? What are you doing tomorrow? And each and every day moving that needle, like make it your business to render top-notch service to your clients. Make it your business to not miss doing the things that serve you. And in return, you are able to serve others around you because that's what this life is about. It's about being able to give back to the world. And surprisingly, when you do that, the world willingly gives you more than what you could ever desire. That's just these unwritten laws. And in life, there's always confusion. There's always things that come up. There's always questions and challenges and things that we may not understand why they're happening. However, if you can take those challenges and you can take the, the everlasting energy that funnels, right? And you don't become a part of it. Life doesn't happen to you. You happen to it. You become that black eye in the tornado where you're able to see things as they happen. The world keeps spinning constantly. If you are able to become that black eye, that, that eye in, in, of the tornado, know that you hold you're the creator of your own life. You hold the keys to what life looks like for you. Your thoughts are either the water or the poison that grows your plants. So either you're constantly watering your plants each and every day or you're not, right? You're leaving them hanging out to dry and hoping that the world is going to come and save you. And surprisingly, if you haven't known this yet, you guys, the people in this group who succeed are the people who are constantly doing. As my husband says, they're constantly taking massive imperfect action. And in that, right, in that, I would like to sprinkle that with living your life with purpose and surrounding yourself around the people, around the goals, around the processes, the systems that directly align with that. 